Hello and welcome to Squarespace Tutorials with Jake Jorgovin. Today I'm going to be showing you how to upload a PDF to Squarespace. To start, uh, what you're going to do is basically have any sort of text that you want to turn into a link. So for example here on this landing page for my ebook, I have this text here that says download the focused creator. Uh, what I'm going to do here is just highlight this text and you can do this with any text anywhere on your site and then I'm going to go up here and I'm going to turn that text into a link so right next to your bold italics you'll see this little edit link icon uh, you want to click this edit link icon and once you do that you're going to see this window pop up that says external files and content what you're going to want to do then is actually click over to this files tab and when you click to files it's going to show you new file or existing file so if you click on existing file this is actually going to show any other files I've ever uploaded to my site if you want to link to something in more than one spot um, but we're going to upload a new file for this so we want to upload a file for the focus creator I'm going to hit upload and I'm going to select my PDF and I'm going to go ahead and upload that to Squarespace uh, and that is the pretty straightforward and simple way to upload a PDF to Squarespace uh, now there is one more trick I need to show you here and that is that uh, when you upload a PDF by default Squarespace is going to have that PDF open up within the existing window on Squarespace. Uh, it's taking a little bit of upload time for me. I'm gonna actually, yeah, there we go. Um, so by default, uh, Squarespace is going to open this link in the same window. So I'll to give you an example. I'm going to save, and then I'm going to view the page. And now when I go to download the Focus Creator and I click this, what actually happens is you see now my whole website is gone and I am just inside of my PDF. Um, so that's a little frustrating and something a lot of people don't like. Um, but what you can do is now that I'm in this PDF, once I have actually navigated over here, I can come up here to the link and I can copy this link and I can change the link back there, uh, back there on the landing page site. So I'm going to copy this link. I'm going to go back to my Squarespace site. I'm going to go down here to the gear icon for the content editor. And once I'm here in the gear icon, I'm going to, or once I'm back in the back end of Squarespace, I'm going to click on this download the focus creator link and I'm going to edit this link now. And so currently it is on a file, but if I want that to open in a new window, I am actually going to change that to an external link. So I'm going to click on external, and then I'm going to paste that link of the PDF into here. So you see this is the static dot squarespace. Oh, that just went away. Um, and then what I'm going to do is I'm going to click open in new window. And once we do that, now this uh, PDF is actually going to open up in a new window. So I'm going to hit Save. And then I'll go to View Page to show you the difference. Now when I come down here and I click Download the Focused Creator, you see it actually just opened up in a new tab on my site. And I still have my website open over here. Uh, so that is how you upload a PDF to Squarespace and how you make that PDF open in a new window. I hope that was useful, and if you have any needs with your Squarespace site, you can reach out to me at jake-jorgovin.com slash Squarespace.